Hey friends, in this video, I'm sharing the recipe for shredded pork skin. This aromatic and flavorful dish is a staple item in many Vietnamese rice plates. Please join me in this short video and I'll walk you through the easy steps. For the ingredients have cooked shredded pork skin, salt, vinegar, garlic cloves, vegetable oil, thin cut pork, coconut water, fish sauce, ground white pepper, salt, and roasted rice powder. Transfer the cooked shredded pork into a salad spinner. Add half a tablespoon salt and one tablespoon distilled white vinegar. Gently combine together. Swirl the shredded pork skin in cold water and then drain. The salt and vinegar helps to clean the pork skin and neutralize any odors. Rinse the pork skin twice. Use a salad spinner to remove the excess water. Transfer the pork skin to a large plate lined with a paper towel. Allow to air dry while continuing with the next steps. Smash the garlic cloves and then finely chop. Transfer into a medium skillet. Add two tablespoons vegetable oil. Fry the garlic over medium heat, stirring constantly. This process doesn't take long. As soon as the oil starts to bubble, it's just another one to two minutes before the garlic is golden. Transfer the fried garlic into a sieve, separating the garlic from the oil. Transfer the pork into a large pan or dish. Sprinkle half a tablespoon salt and half a tablespoon white vinegar on the first side. Lightly rub the mixture onto the pork. Flip the pork onto the other side and repeat the same process. Gently wash the pork under cold running water, rinsing away the salt and vinegar. Pat the meat dry using paper towels. In a measuring cup, add the coconut water, fish sauce, and ground white pepper. Combine the ingredients together. Pour the marinade into a large dish. Transfer the pork into the dish. Flip the pork so that both sides are evenly coated in the marinade. Cover and let marinate for at least 15 minutes. Refrigerate if marinating longer or overnight. Heat a large skillet over medium heat and when hot, add half a tablespoon vegetable oil. Transfer the marinated pork into the skillet. Cook on the first side for two to three minutes, depending on the thickness of the pork. Flip the pork and continue cooking on the second side. You'll start to see a caramel sauce form from the natural pork juices and the coconut water in the marinade. Rotate and flip the pork pieces, coating it in this caramel sauce. Continue pan frying until the pork is fully cooked. For this thin cut pork, the entire cooking process takes about five to six minutes. Transfer to a plate and let cool completely. This will make it easier to slice. Cut the pork into thin strips. This part always takes a little bit of time and I wish there was a faster way. Transfer the shredded pork skin into a large bowl. Using scissors, cut the strands to shorter lengths. Add one quarter teaspoon salt, one quarter teaspoon ground white pepper, one tablespoon roasted rice powder, and half a tablespoon fried garlic. Toss together, making sure the pork skin is evenly coated with the roasted rice powder. Add the sliced pork along with the remaining two tablespoons roasted rice powder and remaining fried garlic. Toss together, combining everything well. Finally, add half a tablespoon fried garlic oil and toss together one more time. To make an awesome rice plate, start with a tomato and cucumber salad and broken rice. Add egg meatloaf and the shredded pork skin. Top with scallion oil and serve with pickles and fish sauce dipping sauce. Please see this video's description for links to the accompanying recipes. Another tasty combination is shredded pork skin with grilled lemongrass pork chops and egg meatloaf. Hi, I hope you've enjoyed this easy how-to video. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to post below. For full recipes, check out runawayrice.com. I work on new recipes each week, so please subscribe to my channel to stay tuned. This is Trang wishing you good eating and good health. Thanks for watching.